If Donald Trump can get away with this, he can get away with anything. Donald Trump is trying to obstruct the Russia investigation. This is about Trump trying to put himself above the law. He has said repeatedly, again and again, that he's upset at Jeff Sessions for recusing himself, for allowing the Russia investigation to go forward. He should have certainly let us know if he was going to recuse himself, and we would have used a, put a different attorney general in. So he made what I consider to be a very terrible mistake for the country. So what does Trump do? He then fires Jeff Sessions, not because of his immigration stance or his hardline positions, which Trump all agrees with, but because Sessions wasn't protecting him. America has only been in this situation a couple times in its history, namely in Watergate, where Richard Nixon fired the special prosecutor that was investigating him, fired the attorney general. And so now we're back in that sort of situation. Americans should be outraged. and should be extremely concerned about this. Why? The Mueller investigation has been producing results. This is not a witch hunt. He knows this investigation is coming after him. He knows that he's in the crosshairs. And so he's trying to end it. And so the way to end it is to put someone in charge of the investigation that can, can quash it, can block evidence from coming forward. They know this guy will do the president's bidding. And what's so outrageous about making him attorney general is that normally what happens in almost every situation is the number two at a, at a government agency, the deputy, becomes the acting attorney general. That's Rod Rosenstein. Why hasn't Trump made Rod Rosenstein the attorney general? Because he wants someone there that's going to protect him. So they picked someone that they knew would do it, that's already written and said that they would do it. Our Justice Department and our FBI have to start doing their job and doing it right and doing it now. At some point, I wanted to stay out, but at some point, if it doesn't straighten out properly, I want them to do their job. I will get involved and I'll get in there if I have to. The Attorney General's job is not to protect the President of the United States. It is to enforce American laws. The American Constitution holds that no one is above the law. We're in a constitutional crisis, and that's what Donald Trump has put us in. So Democrats just won a majority in the House. They now have a responsibility to do what the Republican Congress wouldn't do, which is to serve as a check on this administration and as a check on this president, and to conduct real oversight. When Democrats enter into Congress in January, they need to hold immediate hearings about what just took place, about the Mueller investigation, and to ensure that it's able to continue without interference. This is now a major test for Republicans in the Senate. This is a test of their patriotism. Do they stand with the Constitution that no one is above the law? If Jeff Session is fired, there will be holy hell to pay. Or are they going to stand with Donald Trump? I like Jeff Sessions, but this is just not working. Again and again and again, Republican senators have stood by Donald Trump, have stood there as Donald Trump has attacked the Mueller investigation. Jeff Sessions should make his voice heard that this is unacceptable. He's recused from the Russia investigation, so Jeff Sessions doesn't actually know what's taking place in the Russia investigation. But he knows that what Trump is doing is wrong. He knows why Trump tried to fire him, and that's because Trump is trying to protect himself and put himself above the law. And Jeff Sessions should tell Republican senators that that's unacceptable.